morning. Thanks for joining us for Local 3 News. I'm Brianne McLean. With the cameras on our phones, we can take nearly unlimited pictures. That wasn't always the case. Local 3's Haley Schoengart traveled to Calumet to show us how one person is preserving and restoring history one photo at a time. We're on the mid 90s and some of the first things I did with it were um, with students in school. Uh, I taught a chess class, so I remember taking pictures of kids concentrating, playing chess games, and then putting them in front of an outer space background or something. Um, so I started like that. After retirement and some newfound free time on his hands, he decided to turn his pastime into a business. What I do is I digitize analog media, meaning um, anything uh, like a photograph, a negative, a slide, uh, an old document. Uh, I can scan these, uh, restore them, improve their look, put them back to how they would have looked when they were new, and then make digital files for customers. And often uh, people want reprints of things like that too. You can find images that have crossed through Red Jacket Media Studios all over the UP. From Calumet to the National Ski Hall of Fame, looking in a museum at a flawless finish, you would never know the condition of the original image. In a lot of cases, uh, old photos like that are just going to be very faded. Um, so the exposure and color, if they're a color photo, can be returned to what it should be. Um, and then the other thing is there's just damage. There's scratches, tears, spills, uh, things like that. And so almost always uh, that kind of damage can be fixed and uh, the image can be improved, either a little or a lot. Being able to assist in the process of snapshotting time for Mike is a beyond rewarding experience. Well, people's reactions are great. I mean, I get paid for what I do, but uh, it's just really good uh, to see someone who came in and, and said, well, I've got this and you probably can't do anything with it. And then they're quite amazed, especially if it's a, an old family photo, people who have passed on, they have no negative, uh, relatives have no other copy, it's all they have. And so I've literally had uh, photos torn to pieces, brought in in a little Ziploc bag and pieced it back together. And it's not perfect, but it's better than they thought uh, was possible. So it's enjoyable to see that. Reporting in Calumet, Haley Schongart, Local 3 News. Now for a check on your forecast with meteorologist Tom Kippen. Next slide, Bree, as we look at what's ahead for today, we're looking at some thunderstorm chances. It'll be warm with some humidity. Look for high temperatures today across Upper Michigan in the 70s and 80s. Some of these storms today could have some heavier rain and maybe some hail, also some stronger gustier winds. For Thursday, for tomorrow, though, it's going to turn cooler. Sunshine's back, though, along with some wind. For weather anytime, track the storms today on our free WJ Local 3 app, also online at upmatters.com. That's where we do have an interactive radar at the bottom of the weather page.